Uh, my name is Charlotte Cohn, and I play Ayelet in this production of Handle with Care. My father um, is actually a, a Danish Jew. He survived the Second World War um, in Denmark, and my mom is a Sabra, meaning born and raised in Israel. And they lived in Denmark for 13 years. I was born there, and then we moved to Israel when I was five. And um, you know, in Israel, it's a day to unfortunately, it's a day to day existence where uh, things are set on fire and rocks are thrown at you and bombs go off, so you can't live your life in fear. Serving in the Israeli military is mandatory. Girls have to serve two years, boys have to serve three years. I served a little longer, and by a little I mean three years longer, so I stayed in for five. I was um, first uh, um, sort of, well, social worker, and then I was pulled out to do officer school, and I became an officer and a tank commander uh, training base and then I transferred to the intelligence so all together it was five years. Jason O'Dell Williams is my husband and he wrote the play and so one day in 2008 where you know the economy went like this and he was like oh, nothing's going on I'm going to write something and if I was going to write something for you what would it be what do you want to play and I said I'm really fascinated with miscommunication or not being able to be understood or not being able to speak. And so two weeks later, there was the first draft of Handle With Care. Well, Handle With Care is a romantic comedy. So first of all, if it's any indication from what I've been experiencing in rehearsals, it's, it's a kind of a laugh ride <laughs> for a lot of it. But it's romantic comedy, so it's also, you know, sweet and, and heartwarming. So, you know, the New York Times call us hilarious and heartwarming, you know. So it, it really is that. So people can expect to laugh a lot, but also um, feel that wonderful warm feeling inside and also it, it makes you think about your life and where you are right now and all the things that had to happen to bring you to this moment in time. Mm -hmm.